Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's Mike Marco speaking, and we are going to cover some more configuration aspects of your viral blogging system blog, Firepower Network. Previously, we have talked and had video on how to create banners, how to put banners into your blog, how, and also how to configure the fonts and the background colors in your blog. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to talk about how to change these titles up top to configure them however you like. So we're going to click on the plus. Okay, so you can see here we've already touched on the colors, but now what you're going to do is hit the navigation bar, and now you can configure, you have options to select whether or not you want to turn the existing ones off. So you have all these buttons. Okay, and then so for instance, I want to I can do all of them, but I don't want to turn them all off. Let's see, for instance, you want to turn off I don't know, say vision or welcome or whatever you want to do. And then what you can do is where you, whether you want to take them, take them all off, turn them all on, wherever you want to do it, and then you can create your own links. So for instance, I've done an about us, and then what you need a map. Now, I don't have it uploaded here yet in this blog. Actually, what I did like, as an example, I'm going to show you here what I did on another system here. And this is yourmoneymag.biz. Actually, I'm going to do something switch it over. I had done this one here. I'm going to go to powerfulmoneymagnet.com. Now, you're going to see here in this one here, we actually configured it to only have a couple options about us and the blog post. The blog post basically takes you to obviously to the blogs. And then we have an About Us page. And basically it comes to a discussion about Brent and I. And gives you a little bit of background. So I like to add that to the other blog. So since I haven't posted it, normally what you do is you go ahead and post it as a blog post. Uh, in this case here, I haven't done that. So I'm just going to, kind of, for example's sake, I'm just going to borrow it and show you how to input the link. So basically what I did is I went here and selected the entire selection here and then I hit control C or I believe it's open Apple C or whatever you want to do for your copy or even if you just go up here edit copy okay and then I have the link so you can imagine your blog and I would say okay I want to get that link here and paste in place or edit paste so you have it in place and you notice as soon as I filled this out it creates you can have another link so you can keep on doing that. So for, you can turn them all off. That's what I did on the Powerful Money Magnet blog. Turned them all off and created my own links right here. However you want to configure it, that's one of the beauties of the viral blogging system. You can configure those really quickly and easily. You can configure any of those header options. And the same thing goes for the footer options as well. So let's just save the changes. Now let's go look at the footer. Okay, so you have all these options as well. So for instance, let's go right to the bottom here. So let's see what options we have. You can see here that there's different buttons down here. You can configure that as well. And this is where you do it. Okay, so you have terms and conditions. It sends it to a link. Refund policy sends it to a link and so on. Again, feel free to configure those as well to whatever you want them to be. And you can even add your own. For instance, you can have maybe a contact me button down there. And you can add that down here. Okay, and then it takes you to a it takes them to a page where it basically goes over. Okay, these are all different ways that you can contact me. Uh, it could be your your email listed out, your websites. It could be your your Skype. It could be any number of things. Different ways for them to get a hold of your Facebook page, whatever you like. You can add them there. So just just giving you some examples of things you can do. Um, you can look at other websites, see what other people have done, and you can see something very similar in here as well. Okay? So, I hope with this other information, you can again spend a little bit more time customizing your blog. Now, hopefully at this point, you've done a lot of blog posts. I don't want you jumping into this right away, because without getting some blog posts, you need to get into the rhythm of doing regular blog posts. Don't put the cart before the horse. Just start writing, put them in place, and you can worry about configuration of your blog and make it kind of fancier down the road. Because it's kind of a thing that can be an ongoing. You can always tweak it and change things as you go along. But the key thing is it's a post every day or nearly every day. Okay? 
That's it for now. Have a great one. Bye.